All right, so welcome back to um, Terminator Resistance. I think in the last episode we missed a plasma, not last episode, last stream, we missed a plasma rifle that somebody pointed out in one of the videos that was on one of the T-800. I don't know if we could have picked it up, but I could see it very quickly. There was a hover, a tooltip saying plasma rifle or something. And um, yeah, I'm not sure if we could have picked it up or not, but let's continue here. We have to talk to Jennifer. And to continue the story, Jennifer. Oh, thank God, you're finally here. How did it go? Did you find the soldiers? Yes, I did. I helped them escape from that hospital. You don't give up on your people, do you? I like that. She so likes what now? it. They're supposed to come for me soon. Great. That means that you're going home? No more scavengers constantly nagging you to do things for them? I bet you like the sound of that. Oh, Erin's still up, too. Go talk to her. She won't I admit will. it, but she was just as worried as I was. So you were worried. Do you need help, Do with, you need help with anything? <laughs> Is that your best pickup line? She's Sorry, really not wasting time. I, I tend to do that when I'm stressed. I think I got it from my dad. Oh, your dad started like hitting on people when he got stressed? Right? Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. Don't mind me. Okay. What was he like? Seems you were very close. Seems you were very close. As close as could be. He taught me everything I know. Sometimes without me even knowing. This one time, when I was little, he wanted to make a huge sign that said, Welcome, on the side of our house in Pasadena. So he said, I bet you can't spell that. And of course I had to prove him wrong. Believe me, now I know how stupid that was. Not at all. That was very clever. You're right. Pretty stupid. <laughs> Not at all. That was very clever. Yeah. He was always full of bright ideas. Thanks for trying to make me feel better. After Judgment Day, my dad turned our house into a safe haven. A home for everyone who lost theirs. We were like a family with an endless supply of uncles and aunts. I guess my father wanted to help with the war. We never really used guns. So, the only thing we could do was to help others in need. Seems like he helped a lot of people. He did. Right till the very end. Anyway, it was actually really cool. Everybody loved him, and he loved having them around. I think it's because he always had a brand new audience to listen to his bad jokes. He had this really terrible one. He'd walk into the room and ask if anyone had seen his remote because his team was playing. I always laughed at it. I'll never understand why. All right, I love these stories, by the way. So um, they're actually not that terribly badly written. They're, they're okay, so they're interesting enough. Was well, he a sports fan? Sounds like a champion of dad jokes. <laughs> Was he a sports fan? I don't think so. He had a jersey that he wouldn't let anyone touch. But I don't think it was a token of his love of sports. More like a reminder of simpler times. Look at me yapping. I'm sorry, you probably have enough on your plate. Anyway, thanks. It's really nice to have someone to talk to. Anytime. Jennifer appreciates it. Her little brother doesn't, though. Like, So he gives us bullets and tells us there's only one bullet needed for us. So we're finished with Jennifer. And we have to talk to Aaron now. No need to worry. I'm fine. <sighs> Who said I was worried? <laughs> I've been thinking a lot about it, and if I can, I've decided to join the Resistance. That's good news. I'll do more good there than here. I'm glad to hear that. I just hope you're better supplied over there than we are. Speaking of which, I see you've got those antibiotics I asked for. Good. Now I can call Ryan off. Who said they're for you? I asked him if he brought a shovel with him. If you think that was too morbid, he said that after Judgment Day, digging graves was one of the few things he actually got better at. Okay, I don't know if that's a good thing, but okay. <laughs> oh, we got trade resources. We got 300 quid. Excellent. Or trade resources. Okay, we got two more skill points available. Very good. Oh, we got two skill points now in one go as we leveled up. That's actually really handy. New quest added into the storm. 
So let's quickly check our skill points again. So if we have two now, do they get more expensive later on? I don't know. I don't think so. I think they always will cost two. So weapons inflict 25% more damage. So this is for damage multiplier. So I'm going to keep my points from that. This one here is to actually give us access to more things. The hacking, I would actually think, might actually be of worth. Uh, hack easy terminals increase hacking attempts. And I do think that we find some really nice things in the lockpicking, but I keep that extra point here for, for the moment, just in case. Okay, so, you know, just it would be good to have that point spare if we come across something where we go, oh yeah, let's spend that extra point in um, whatever, you know, hacking or in lockpicking or whatever, whatever we come across. So let's see, what do we have to do? Where do we have to go? Oh, I have to rest, go to sleep. Oh, okay. A few days later. Okay. I'm suspicious now. Oh, the resistance got of course the resistance. We told them where we were. Okay. Private Rivers. Yes, sir. I've got a message from South Division's field commander Baron. She's agreed to meet with you. She set up a rendezvous point at the unfinished metro station. You'll need to enter the canal system under the bridge. Okay. The meeting's supposed to take place tomorrow, so I suggest moving out soon. Understood. And, Rivers, because of what you did for our guys at that hospital, I'll give you a heads up about Commander Baron. Don't expect a warm welcome. Hmm, okay, save her people and don't get a warm welcome. Looks like you're leaving us soon. Aaron wants to join me. What about you? What do you think about enlisting? Me? <laughs> no. I still have hope I'll get that bus running again. Also, I don't like the attention Skynet's given you guys. I'd rather stay as far from the line of fire as possible. <laughs> Patrick, get back here! Oh, what happened? You better go see what's going on. Oh, the little dude just went off. Okay. Um, thank you very much for the host, by the way, uh, Jamie and Badman. Very much appreciated. Um, let's see what's going on. Jennifer, I think we just have to forget about Patrick, okay? He's a liability. He's, he's dead. I think, I think he's, he's, we might as well write him off. Let's just talk over, over dinner over it and get closure. Is everything all right? Is that a good idea? Patrick's decided that he wants to be a scavenger. And now he won't come out. Even though I'm worried sick, he'll get stuck. Get back here right now, Patrick! But there's lots of cool stuff in here. You told me it's our job to find stuff for the group. Yeah, he's done. Like, he's he's dead. Like, we should just forget about him. See what's in there. See, I would be... I, I have to agree with his sister, you know. It's just... You your know, sister is just, right. Get back here. It's too dangerous. You see, I don't care if he hates me, you know. I care oh, if Jennifer all right, hates all me. Right. Coming out. Look at him. He's like, he's like a dirty rascal. What was that all about just now? What? I've got a meeting with Commander Baron. Oh, I thought she was giving out to me soon. about calling him. Okay. I'm going with you. And don't even <laughs> try to stop me. Are you sure? Okay. What's the matter? Don't they let you boys bring dates? She is so forward. She hits on people when she's getting stressed. Don't you give me the eye. And if I find another bullet on my nightstand, we're going to have a chat, little man. Don't worry, kid. She's just worried about you. But she never lets me do anything. That's what older siblings do. They look out for us. Exactly. You tell is your him. brother like that, too? Well, not really. Okay, you Danny Clover. You got that. You did. You got that, Danny. Okay, so let's see. Leave the hideout. Yes. Field Commander Baron agreed to meet with me at the unfinished metro station. I will finally get to deliver the message about the existence of the new threat, a half man, half machine, being created by Skynet. The question. The question is, will she believe me? Well, do we really care if she believes us, though? I mean, our job was to deliver the Looks message. Looks like we got here first. Is everything all right? You seem a little out of it. <sighs> Sorry. I probably shouldn't zone out like that with a gun in my hands, huh? <laughs> Am I making you nervous? No. No, not really. <laughs> no, not really. Well, you should be. 
I don't have any formal training like you. I never even held a gun until recently. Can I be honest with you? Sure. There's a reason I decided to come here with you. I want to meet Commander Baron myself. Oh. They're here. When I heard that Private Rivers of the non-existent Pacific Division wants, no, needs to have a meeting with me, I thought, oh, what a lucky girl I am. But then I started thinking, who is Private Rivers? And why should I treat him as anything other than the deserter he is? <laughs> so right now I'm hoping you give me a good reason why I shouldn't just skip the court-martial and execute you where you stand. This is bullshit. And who do we have here? A brave scavenger? Rivers, do you always bring unauthorized civilians to fight your battles for you? We would have got to you sooner if you hadn't pulled out all your troops from Pasadena. People died there because of you! And what did you do about it? Did you pick up a gun and fight back? Or did you run like you sewer rats always do? Ooh. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Stay out of this. Okay, we, we, we gotta go. Jennifer's make right. There's no need for any of that. Yeah. Today is all about private rivers. So what can you tell me that I don't know already? A few weeks ago, the outpost I was stationed at was ambushed by a Terminator, I think. It was half man, half machine. The entire Pacific Division was wiped out by a single enemy. Half man, half machine? What are you talking about? How did your men let an enemy get that close to you? And we didn't know it was a machine. It could walk, talk, bleed, sweat. There was no way to distinguish it as an enemy. It infiltrated us perfectly. This infiltrator, is it still alive? I I'm not sure. Okay, for now keep everything to yourself. I don't want any rumors, especially since you only think you saw something. Skynet's coming! We're not done here yet, Rivers. Take this plasma. Oh yes, plasma. You're a resistance soldier. Time to act like one. Excellent. To your positions! Okay, where's my plasma rifle? Drones! Up there! Fire at will! There Take cover! Don't be shy, Rivers! This is a great time to impress me! Okay, I can impress you, but I don't know if I want to. You're very rude. I think I got one! You think you got one? I already got four. Impressed? Go. Please let me pick up all the parts. There are gonna be so many More parts. Come. We need to move. Yes, yes, yes. I just gotta scavenge some parts. Get that door open. Let's go. Door. Fall back. Fall back. Eyes on that door. Okay. Terminators. Um, are we gonna go for their face or something? Okay. Better hitboxes than seven days to die, that's for sure. There we go. Nice. Love it. So clear! Oh, no, no, no! Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Go, go, go. Yeah, we have to better hurry up. Let me just pick up these things quickly! I'm coming, I'm coming. More medals! Up there! On that balcony! What are we talking about? Where? Okay. Oh, oh, that was the music box. Neutralized! Shoot those gas canisters! More drones! You with that AK! Take care of them! On it! Okay, excellent. Through that balcony! I'm all out of ammo! Yeah, I got plenty of ammo, so don't worry about it. Oh, nice. What do we got here? There's more ammunition than med kit. Actually, that's a very good idea. Oh, crap. Okay, that's just a music box. Let's go! 
You can be sure there's gonna be more. I have to change. There we go. Pipe bombs. Armored spider ahead. Don't let it get near you. More terminators. How many? I count three. Okay, hang on a second. Gas bottle. One less. More incoming. Keep your position. Got him. Okay, let me flank. Let me flank. Oh, what do we have here? Yeah, let's flank. There we go. He's done. Let's keep moving. Almost there. And uh, there's a couple of more boxes with ammo, I think. Fucking throw them! There we go. What is this? Oh, nice trade resource. Don't you skip past any of the good loot, man. Don't you let me skip... Oh, hello. Ow! What are we looking at? You see, I got it. I got it. Okay. I'm getting us out of this! Oh, look there. Skynet Plasma Rifle. Nice. Oh, yes. Can I pick that one up? Because they sell probably for a very good penny. This time I picked it up. Ah. What do we have here? Oh, nice. Oh, yes. Goody, goody. There we go. Look at all these explosive materials. That is really, really good. See, a lesson learned there. In a real-life scenario, always split away from the crew to scavenge. <laughs> ah, balls. What was that? This was an ambush. They no, knew really? we were coming. How did they know? With the annihilation line getting closer, they must have eavesdropped on our conversation. We're on their radar now. God damn it! They were waiting for us! We're surrounded! Take positions! Okay, hang on a second. I got this! Leaving already? Oh man, critical hit. Okay, so let me do There's quick... too many of them! The big mesh Hold kit. It. There we go. Through here! Come on! Follow her! Oh, there's just too many. Yeah, we're gonna have to split. Okay, they're behind us. They're not in front of us, which is good. Watch out! Take cover! No! Oh! We need to help him! He's dead. You want to help someone? Help yourself and take his rifle. Okay. I take it because I can sell it. Who took his rifle? I was going to take his rifle. Damn it. These greedy soldiers. Hang on a second. There's a green dot. Does that mean he still has something? No. I can't actually shoot him. That is interesting. It won't let me shoot him. Huh. I know he's dead, but you know, you just have to make sure. More of them up here! Stay low! Don't stop shooting! Okay, weapons are ineffective. Oh, yes. Here we go. Excellent. He's close. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Oh, wow. Okay, that was close. There we go. Let's 
throw a little. Headshots seem to be working the best. Plasma. Okay, how much room do I have? Ooh, we only have one more field. These guys must be worth a pretty penny. I'm coming, I'm coming. Where are they? Over there. Okay. Can't pick up any more weapons now. There's a shortcut that'll get us out of here. We just have to make our way to that industrial building. As soon as that aerial moves, we run. Okay, you lead. Let's go. It's clear. Go! We're getting close. What? I wonder, should we spend? I mean, we're going to level up again. Should we spend the points on the weapons? Inflict more... Yeah, I think more damage might actually be a good idea. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, why don't you just push me out of the way then, Mr. Rudy Pants? Okay, let's go. This time we're I'm going to stay right here. No, I'm not going to stay close. Go, 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 go. Okay, maybe we're just going to run ahead now. So let's just, let's just go for it. We're getting close. Okay, I did, I did, I did, I made it, I made it. Okay, good, good, good. Up there! Oh no! Jacob! Okay, we didn't die. Rivers! Are you okay? Shoot that thing! Okay. Jacob, get up! Can I lose it though? Yeah, it's very important that we get to lose it. Oh. Yes. We'll cover you! Get out of there! Oh, crap. Excellent. That was good shooting. That 10% damage, I feel it makes a difference. I think it makes a difference. Oh! Didn't even realize he was there. Okay, we can't pick up his gun, but we can search him. Okay, looking at the map if there's anybody else. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Thank God you're okay. Save that for later. We're not safe yet. <laughs> we need to get the hell out of here. I think we're she's two. just jealous that Jennifer the and shelter. I have such a good repertoire. Oh god. Bro. Oh, can we loot this? No. Oh. Okay, we made it, I think. <laughs> Resistance shelter. I was able to deliver my message to Commander Baron, but Scanner was waiting for us. You always have time to loot. Always have time to loot. I'm, uh. I'm sorry about before. And I'm sorry about your soldiers. No need for that. 
You'll have a hard time getting up every morning if you dwell on that too much. Machines don't do that, and if we want to destroy them, neither can we. Sassy pants. Bossy pants. Rivers, since Pacific Division no longer exists, you will now answer to me. That makes you a part of Techcom. Congratulations. No more sitting around waiting for Skynet to come to you. Over here we go out there and meet the enemy face on. Okay. Not that I like you bossing me around, but fair this enough. Is it. Resistance Shelter South Division. Baron, DN38217. I can't move, she's right in my face. Commander. There with me. Where are the others? Where's my husband? They're dead. <laughs> I'm sorry. Over here is our quartermaster. It's if you need anything beyond the standard issue equipment, <laughs> work it out with him. And here's Alvin, residing chief Egghead. Uh, I prefer laboratory director. <laughs> like I said, Egghead. He I, I supplies like her. all techcom units with weapon modifications. <laughs> Everything looks well organized. Where's my husband? Dead. They're Everyone dead. pulls their weight here. If someone doesn't, we become weak. And you can probably imagine where I stand on being weak. I don't know if I'm afraid I'll of right her or intrigued. There's a reason I decided to meet you. Because we you We some interesting data. It turns out you're part of a prestigious group. Oh, okay. A group of people that Skynet marked for termination. See, John Connor, the leader of the Resistance, is number one on that list. Then, there's me. I know, I'm flattered. Every day, we lead, we fight, and we plan on how to destroy Skynet's central core. So I know exactly why we're on that fucking list. But why would Private Rivers be number three? That infiltrator said something about me being marked for termination. Huh. Interesting. I'll have to have a word with Connor about that. And that brings me to my second point, your first assignment. After the Annihilation Line got to Pasadena, Skynet started building installations there. I want you to go there and collect some intel, so we know what we're up against. Sounds dangerous. It I will like be. It. Check with Alvin before you go. He'll have something for you. Remember, you might be valuable to Skynet, but the way I see it, you're still a private. Dismissed. <laughs> okay, I'm very and confused Rivers right now. <laughs> Civilians don't need to know about what happened out there. Okay. Oh, I, I like the way she so ladylike sits there now after she told everybody in the most directest way that their loved ones are dead and, you know, ashes. So we probably have some uh, stuff to upgrade our gear, is it? Do we have like some... Oh, okay. Let me see. There's some green dots on the map. You're going back to Pasadena? Can't imagine what it's like there now. Don't worry, Jennifer. You're still my number one girl. You, you're not as bossy. There we go. Okay. I hear you have something for me. I do. Commander Baron wanted me to show you how to customize your weapons. Yes. Something I've been working on for some time now. You see, your standard phased plasma is in a 40 watt range. However, you can upgrade its damage, shooting rate, or stability using decoded chips. Well, the same a few ones of them. you've been collecting from fallen terminators. You can do the upgrades yourself. When you're done, go to the quartermaster. I believe he has something for you as well. Good, I like it. So, weapon upgrades. Open inventory, select a plasma weapon to upgrade, select the upgrade button, close the circuit by matching three chips in the slots. Each chip ending must match the adjacent chip from both sides. Oh, okay. I guess. I, I think I get it. Let's just try it out. Inventory. So we have a plasma rifle and then we have the Skynet plasma, which is stronger. So this one here, I think this one here is stronger. Oh, look at that. This one here is 75, fire rate 475, stability 98, clip size 24, shots... Oh, this one doesn't even need a clip size. 
So this is just, it just overheats. I think we should keep both of them. The, the one I'm using the least is actually this one here. So I think we should just do this. Your weapon skill is too low. Okay, hang on a second. I thought we upgraded weapons. My weapon skill is too long. Okay, we definitely have to do this. We definitely, we want to get more experience. Now, what do you mean my weapon skill is too long? Weapon 3 is required. Okay, I think we can do that. There we go, there's one. There's two. And we're gonna get three after that, so we're gonna level up soon enough. Use Skynet first generation plasma weapon, red. Okay, so this weapon is obviously better than what um, I have in the moment, but um, let's upgrade this one here first, see. To upgrade a weapon, close the circuit by matching three clips, chips in the slots. Each chip ending must match the adjacent chip from both sides. So what happens? Why is the circuit disconnect? Oh, this end doesn't match. Are you kidding me? No way, they also have to match. So, in this case, we can put some damage back in. There we go, plus 12 damage. And if we can exchange a fire rate for Eclipse size, that would be amazing. There we go. Yes. Okay. I think we got this done now. Let's um, activate. Okay. So that was our first time upgrading a weapon. That was very annoying. <laughs> Do the colors represent rarity? I don't know actually what the colors represent. Yeah, that's a bit... That's something that kind of confuses me a little bit. So let's see if we can upgrade our current one as well. 22 extra damage and 5 clip size. Excellent. Okay. Beautiful. 